So till now we have implemented all the methods that were required to basically add a plan and then uh, we allow the user to tap on the screen using the AR camera which is basically the user will simply tap and a point will be added uh, on the camera and then let's say when the uh, user tap for the second time that is let's say the second point then a line will be drawn between two points and let's say the user draw a tap for the third time then the third point will be added and a line will be draw to the third line also so you will see it when we will test the app so as you know that uh, we have uh, implemented all these important methods now the next thing is basically uh, we have not yet implemented the function which will basically open our AR view or you can say the AR camera so whenever the uh, AR AR kit view created we will uh, simply call this function okay so just come here if you remember uh, inside the body container we can simply uh, now create our AR kit scene view okay so we can say child AR kit scene view and we can say show feature points true plan deduction plan deduction AR plan deduction dot horizontal and then we can say on AR kit view created we will call a function which we will implement now by the name on AR view created and also let's enable the tap recognizer enable tap recognizer to true now let us just implement this function on AR view created so here we can say on AR view created we will pass one parameter to it which will be ARKit controller ARKit controller the return type for this will be white we can say this dot ARKit controller equals to ARKit controller this dot ARKit controller dot on dot on add node for anchor and we will assign I mean call our function which is add anchor function after this we can say this dot arkit controller dot on update node for anchor and we will call our function which is update anchor and then this dot arkit controller dot on ar tap equals to inside the parenthesis we can say list angular braces and ar kit test result let's give it name as ar then let's add curly braces make sure to put semicolon and then we can say final tap equals to let's give it a proper name which is plan tap equals to ar dot first wear let's change this name to tap okay just like this and then we can say tap dot type if this becomes equals to ar kit hit test result type dot existing plan using extent let's move this to the next line so that we can see it more easily this is our first way make sure to put a semicolon here just like this okay and then we can add a comma and we can say or else null and after this plan tap is not equals to null then we will simply call our function which is plan tap handler on plan tap handle plan tap dot world transform 